What's up, we're swimmers. Oh, do you want to start? No. What's up, we're David Schwimmers. With Noisy. And you're watching Friends. <laughs> Hi, once again, we're swimmers from Oakland, California. Hi, this is our last song. It's about Los Angeles. It fucking sucks. Light L's, make it glow, it takes a toll on my health, melt, make it snow when I scrape my skull, dandruff, bitches can't stand it, I made a mold, might as well be the patron saint of hating hoes, next second, sex and making love to this angel though, isn't it perplexing, switch of a second, I change my tone, guess addressing that question, that's what makes me groan, got a wifey at home and I made it known. Cats with they chin up, man, you made of bones, bellies and brains. Y'all get body, belly with pain. Shit's garbage, cat on canal. Tried to sell me the same, I ain't stupid, can't tell me to change, I won't do it. I heard hove, saw him too. No, it ain't true, but I know I will never change. I forever blame, teach cops, govs for my problems. All them until they solve them, when it rains. I blame the weather man, can't explain. Now it don't make no sense, that's exactly why I never change. Me want energy. Now start it. Come in, love here. Well, you don't know love is in here. If you have a love, I put your one in on the air. But when I go, I gotta check up, I'm gonna go. And they get it, and they get it, and they get it. I'm not a politician. I believe I can serve my community much better in my position. Get I did not have to get politics for them to refer to me as president. So this is where I grew up from. This is where you grew up? Yeah. My neighborhood, Kamocha. Everybody you see here is extremely, extremely talented. Come here, Zex. Come here. Come here. Give him a freestyle, three seconds. Ting and be gueba si goba me toba man si de. Boom! Bilanji danji, ebilala danji, ebilala danji. And me say me sprink and me splash it, me paint it up. Bilanji danji, bilanji danji, bilanji danji. Yeah, man. There's some great artwork going on here. Yeah, definitely, man. Yeah, we celebrate Malcolm X. 
and for what he stood for. We celebrate Gaddafi, Nelson Mandela, father of nations. Yeah. And we have this little boy and called Bobby little One. Boy. <laughs> he's this little handsome boy. Yeah. <laughs> so we're still, well, the, the journey is still going. Hello. Welcome to my place. Thanks, good to see you. <laughs> and Salom. Ah. Okay, Solomon, you have to give us a lazy body freestyle. All right, give me a freestyle, Solomon. How much up like a crazy body? Gala to the car, you can add your damn gully. Watch all the gully, I'm in past body. Gala to the boss, I'm in unbreast of body. Watch your finger, everything grown up. Back it, back it. You know, I rear pigs. That's part of my business. I do lots of farming. I think you're the only pop star I've ever met who's also a pig farmer. <laughs> you don't see Michael Jackson being a pig farmer. I know, you see. All together, I employ more than 150 people permanently. My fellow artists, they tease me about being a farmer. They think it's not cool. And I think it's not cool to be broke. <laughs> I want my children to grow up uh, knowing that actually it is cool to, to, to grow your own food. You're a businessman. No, I'm a leader. <laughs> You live in this amazing gated house with these beautiful grounds. Yeah. Just outside, there's slums. Yeah, but I chose not to go in the hills, not to build in the hills. I chose to come in this neighborhood and live here. Mm -hmm. So I can still be attached to my people. I'm never detached to my people. My role is to bring people together, to lead them, because you know, a leader sees the way, goes the way and shows the way. And that's what I want to do. It's Carrie Fo, and you're watching Noisy and Friends. They be asking me questions about how I got so fly. I just do what I do, babe, I don't even try. I keep the block hot like the 4th of July. Somebody told me I look like Tyler Creator. And I wasn't really mad at that because I think Tyler Creator, like, he's not ugly, so I mean, it's like, whatever. Oh, no, 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 no. Somebody told me I look like Macaulay Culkin on Home Alone. You know I got this shit that takes you high up. My master plan for controlling the culture, being myself, because I'm popping this shit, and that's all you gotta do. They take your essence, then they're gonna influence other people, and then once they influence other people with what they took from you, you control the culture. If that makes sense. I don't know if that makes sense or not, but. It's my love that you require. What are we gonna do about ISIS? Nigga, I don't know. Like, I don't know what we're gonna do about ISIS, Donald Trump. Like, I can only tell you what I'm gonna do when I leave here. That's it. And what am I gonna do when I leave here? Smoke weed. You know I got the futuristic fire. You know I got the shit that takes you high up. The world without the internet looks like chaos because so many people would be lost and broke. Like, kids don't even know life without the internet. At all. Make it hot, make it hot. Don't stop, don't stop. Make it hot, make it hot. Don't stop, don't stop. <laughs> Hey, what's going on? I'm Cameron Killer Cam. Right now we're in my crib, as you can see. Today what we're cooking is lamb. I'm gonna make some shell steak, asparagus, shrimp scampi, and corn on the cob. So let's start prepping the food. A lot of people don't know. I'm a rapper first, interior decorator second, then I'm a chef third. When I cook steak, I don't just season the meat, I also season the pan that I cook it in. It'll be like a light gravy left over. 
I know they like, I know Killer Cam and they in there dicing. Yeah, I dice, baby. Sometimes you gotta dice, man. Can't eat Chinese food every night. I disguise my ingredients in here because I don't need any of y'all out there biting on what I use. Special recipe from Killer, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna come back in here and revisit this steak. We add a little more seasoning for its final taste, but this is like how I like to set it off. We're gonna cook that at probably 375. A lot of people like to cook on top of the stove because it's quicker, but they're underestimating the oven. Oven is that, is that joint. This is probably my most requested dish, to be honest. Friends come over, camp, can you make some shrimp scampi? Like, I'm a scampi man, you know what I'm saying? They love me for the scampi. We'll do a whole stick of butter. And what you do is you also get the olive oil. If you put butter in the pan by itself, it'll burn and it'll stick to the pan. Let me let you know another thing. Shrimp scampi probably takes 10 minutes to cook. Me, it'll take probably 20 minutes because I like my shrimp scampi almost to come off the tail. I don't really measure the salt or pepper. I do it more by eye because I'm that good. You know, I'm that good that I don't really need to measure. And what I do is I always put two or three extra shrimp in there so that I can taste mm. <laughs> and make sure it's to the liking that I like. We grease the pan good, make sure that the meat doesn't stick. I season the pan with uh, garlic pepper. Usually I be in here moving around while I cook. I get a little groove. I throw on some beats. I write some music while I'm cooking, but I need atmosphere. I love atmosphere. Hey! We'll put through a little lemon. Yeah, just add a little more flavor on it. We're running out, but when you're a chef such as myself, you keep two or three everything, baby. Gotta have two or three of everything, you know what I mean? Cause I like to put a little Worcestershire sauce also in this. Notice the coordination with everything I got going on here. Let's lower this because it's starting to bubble. Chop up some of this asparry. I call it the asparry. There's a little Miss Dash when I throw the corn in here just to season it up. We're pretty much almost a go, fellas. Smelling good. I know you people out there can't smell it, but if your TV had a scratch and sniff, boy, shoo, <laughs> you'd be winning. Okay, so we finished off everything, people. We got shrimp scampi, sauteed asparagus, lamb chops, mm, them lamb chops, boy. Corn on the cob, and steak with bell peppers and onions. Killer meal from Killer Can. Signing off.